guys welcome back to my channel so today I thought I would do a quick tutorial for you guys Um, I just got back from the gym hence the gym wear Um, yeah so I just got back from the gym and I'm about to make some green juice so I thought why not just film the process and show you guys what I put into my green juice and just share with you guys really because I know you guys always want to know like what stuff I eat and you know little tips to like stay healthy and stuff like that but anyways I love making green juice I've been making it for ages but um, over time I have come to just love some staple ingredients in my green juice because it just makes me feel so good and whenever I'm feeling a little bit like run down or just a bit groggy I just make some of this green juice and instantly like it's just such a pick-me-up it just makes me feel so like cleansed and healthy from the inside out and all that cheesy stuff um, but yeah I'm just gonna show you guys what I put into it and yeah so I have all of my ingredients laid out nice and neatly for you guys usually I would just throw everything you know chop it up and throw it in as I'm going along but um, yeah I have everything all laid out neatly for you guys so first of all spinach spinach is just my go-to leafy green for my green juices I did try kale before but I just didn't like the texture of it so yeah I stuck the spinach just just a handful of spinach um today I'm going to be using strawberries usually I always have one wild card fruit I should say um, it might be pineapple it might be peaches might be blueberries or raspberries but today um I picked up some strawberries from my local super value they're on sale two for five euro guys if you live in Dublin um so yeah I have some strawberries there cucumber really high water content I just love getting as much cucumber in my diet as possible it's high in fiber as well if you don't peel the skin off of it and gives it a really really nice fresh taste celery again I really like the fresh taste like I feel like celery is one of those kind of things where you either love it or you hate it I love celery like when I get buffalo wings in the restaurant and they put the celery I know a lot of people just leave the celery I'm one of those people who eats the celery and yeah I just love celery um, banana is just one of my favorite fruits it's high in carbs not super high but it's it's good carbs um, high in potassium and I just love the taste of banana flavoured anything. If you know me, I love my bananas. Um, I have some lind, lind, I have some milled lind seeds here for some fibre. Always love to get as much fibre as possible in my diet. Um, I have just a bit of lemon. Now, I'm just going to use the lemon juice from this. I'm not going to throw the whole thing in because I have tried making green juice with the, you know, the skin or whatever, the peel. And it's horrible like it just doesn't blend properly I know I have a crap blender it's not even a proper juicer or anything but it's just really bitter you know when you get the white part in it it's not nice anymore so just the juice from the lemon and then I have some ginger peeled and thinly sliced I love ginger it's really healthy for you it's a good um, what is it? It's an antioxidant, antibacterial agent. It's just really good for, you know, keeping your immune system healthy. Bonus for today is my bulk powders. Uh, what is this? I think it's the lemon meringue flavor, pure whey. Um, I haven't had my post gym protein shake yet, so I'm just gonna throw that in for today. And voila, this is what I like to put into my green juices. And I did used to have like milk or yogurt and stuff like that in as well. But now I just like to keep it really simple and I just go with water. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw everything into my blender here. Oops, I just spilled water on the table. I'm just gonna go ahead and throw everything in here. So we have spinach cucumbers bananas celery oh still a tiny bit of celery left in there strawberries ginger linseeds and squeeze of lemon 
I'm already after taking all the pips out of this by the way because the last thing I want is to be digging my hands in there trying to get the pips out. Super annoying. Yeah, I'm just gonna squeeze a good bit of lemon juice into that. Protein powder, get it all in there. I'm just gonna go ahead and add the water. Now I don't like to add too much water because like I said, um, most of these vegetables are high in water themselves so you'd be surprised how much juice like how much volume you get out of you know all that plus a tiny bit of water like I don't want it to be too much so I have my blender here don't watch the blender guys it is super old super super old <laughs> that's all done it's nice and liquefied that's what it looks like nice and smooth and normally like I would just go ahead and taste it just in case I need to add anything before I pour it out that tastes good so that's pretty much it guys awesome 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 yeah see what I meant this is like about 500 400 to 500 mils um that's how much this glass can hold and I still have so much left in the blender and I only added like 100 mils of water so yeah a little bit goes a long way with all these you know fruits and veg and stuff like that so yeah guys that is pretty much it I hope you guys find this video helpful and leave a comment below and let me know what are some of your favorite ingredients to make a smoothie slash juice with and why and um yeah I will see you guys next time bye